Hello, Beauty News family. Welcome to just a, uh, I don't know, a slash whole slash vlog, vlog thing. Kind of like to the Sephora one. Yeah, yeah. So we were invited to the, is it pronounced? Miniso? Miniso? Maybe Miniso. Miniso. So Miniso has recently opened in Harbour Town yep. in Docklands. Yeah. And we were invited along by Melissa. She's mm -hmm. a YouTuber, by the way. Yeah. We're going to leave her details down below so mm -hmm. you can check her out. She does some cool shit. She does. I like to say that she does stuff that I am too lazy to do. Like 10 yep. looks using one palette and yep. amazing shit. Like dedicated like a, yeah, stuff. Super, yep. super good. So... She invited us along mm -hmm. and um, we went to check it out because we really love Japanese stuff. We do. We really do. <laughs> and we also love supporting fellow Melbourne YouTubers. Absolutely. And she opened the store. So, yeah. like, good on her. I'm, fan. like, all for supporting friends and shit like that. Yeah, so, totally. Uh, we went down. It was quite a show, I can tell yeah, you. Yeah, I know. They had, like, drummers drumming. The drummers were cool. That was really cool. Um, I, I, I got there and I'm just like, I hear drumming. I know. When I got there, I was like, I betcha it's just around the corner. Yeah. <laughs> Follow yeah. the sound of the drums. Mm -hmm. So we did a little bit of shopping and we were also both given super generous goodie bags. Yeah. So we're going to get into it, show you some of the stuff that you can pick up at Miniso. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think one thing to mention is that it's a very affordable store yeah. and they carry a really wide variety of products. So everything from like homewares, they have a huge selection of soft toys, which yeah. we will get into. I bought three pairs of socks as well. Yeah. So, so like they're out there. I'll go get them in a second. They've also got like beauty products and yeah. like, it's it's kind of a one stop shop for things that you need. Yeah. A little bit like Daiso, but not as out of control. I think also the difference with Daiso. Well, firstly, this isn't just like two dollars no, or two dollars eighty no. or whatever. Um, it's a. It depends on the product, but yeah. they are all very affordable, affordable yeah. um but also they don't have like the smally kind of like the snacks and the no they're more like little technology things yeah. little homeware things um some clothing items it's more focused yeah 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 all right so let's get into it yeah shall we go through both at the same yeah, time let's do it let's start with the soft toys oh yes because they really do have a lot of soft toys oh my toys. god they had the cutest christmas penguin it was so cute and they actually had it in varying sizes. I wanted this massive the one. huge one. So cute and quite affordable too. Yeah. So um, I bought one that looks like my cat. And they gave us both Santa Claus ones. And they're so soft and, they're and squidgy. squidgy. It's like... Yeah. They are so squidgy. So I got... This is like a cat sort of cushion thing. I just kind of put it on my couch. Looks like baby. And it looks like my cat baby. So... um. I showed it and Baby wasn't impressed. He's no, like, what baby, is this? Baby looked at it like it was the devil in He's like, what is this? Yeah. Look, I'm sure if someone came up to me with like a soft toy version of me, like I'd be you? like, what is that? What the fuck so is I don't, that? I don't blame him, but I did buy it because it looked like my cat. I really like these. Yeah. I, I think the quality is really nice and they were super affordable. Yeah. So there you go. Like I think the one that I got was under $10. Yes. Yeah. Um, they also have like a lot of homewares, not homewares, beauty products. Yes. You picked up a bunch of cotton pads. Yes, because I'm always on the hunt for the perfect cotton pads. I should actually have bought more because I'm really out. We're, yeah, cotton but pads. These were bomb. only a couple of dollars. You get 180 in each. Um, and you can get pink ones. Yay! I just throw pink. it away. And they're in a resealable bag too, which That's I like. That's super cool. It's, it's handy. The resealable bags are really good idea. Yeah, they are. So, there we go. This gift bag is jam-packed full of beauty products. Yeah. Which, as you can imagine, because... We're beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we are. We are indeed. Oh, There's shit. actually a lot of things in here we were looking at at the store and we were considering purchasing them and then someone would whisper in our ear, it's in your bag. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Melissa's mum. Oh, she was so, so sweet. Cute. What a cutie. So cute. Yeah, we so, loved her. We want to adopt her as our mum. Yeah, we love her. So we saw this on the shelf and we thought it was a fantastic idea. It's a mask 
set. And yeah. essentially what, what you get is a mask brush, um, a bowl, some little scoops, and then some of the compressed facial sheets. Yeah. So you can like um, rehydrate them with your own serum and then wear um, or a you know, toner. Sheet yeah, and then, yeah, or a toner. And you can buy them in the big bags as well. Yeah. So if you really like um, doing and that. And there's also like a mixing spatula in there. So it's kind of like a, a little mask yeah. set. Yeah. It's a good little head. I think it's, I think it's, it's clever. Have. Yeah. Something else that we were totally stocked up on. Yeah. Thanks and, to this trip. But we were also looking at, and then we also got a. It's yeah, in your bag. It's in your bag. Uh, sponges. Yeah. New sponges. They've got them coming out the wazoo. So and they're, they're pretty cheap, only a few dollars. Yes. So there's a duo pack and then there's the singles. So the traditional egg and then the sort of hourglass egg shade. Mm -hmm. Oh, they feel very beauty blender-esque. How's that one? a little bit firmer. Oh, they've got different oh, textures. Oh, different textures. Yeah. That's cool. That's really cool. I love the shape of this. So this one's a little bit uh, this softer one, yeah, this than one's that one. a bit one. firmer, but I'm curious. It I'm feels curious. good, and it's also got the flat edge. Very good. I'm going to try it. Nail polish remover stack. So <laughs> this is a twin pack of... These are strawberry scented. I got watermelon. Yum. Maybe we should swap yeah, one Yeah, swap each. one each. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, they're nail polish cleansing wipes. I really like this. This yeah. is like, this makes nail polish removal on the go or when you're like, you know, at your desk and you're like, where are all of the things mm -hmm. for removing the disgrace that is my current state of hands? I know that feeling. These are great. So I'm, I'm excited to try these. They're 48 pieces in a pack. And there's two packs. And there is two packs. Yeah, let's talk about perfumes. They do have a cool selection of perfumes. Huge um, selection. Some that we thought were really cool were like the star sign yeah. perfumes. So Hayley got the Scorpio one. I did, yes. Um, I got the Taurus one. They all have different scents. I don't know what the notes are, but they definitely all smell different. So you can yeah. either go for the one that is your star sign. There's a little description of what we're like on the side as well. I'm a prudent Taurus. Mine says a mystical Scorpio, indifferent, mystical and sexy. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Miniso, I am. I've got a reliable and organised, would spare no effort to strive for his target. I'm not very organised. No. So was... <gasps> okay, she's done. Yeah. But not through organisation. No, no. Through sheer determination. Mm -hmm. But they're really cute. And I think these were like $3 or something. Yeah, $4. they were really affordable and super duper cute. And also the fact that it's like kind of a personalised perfume. Yeah, I like they're really that. fucking cute. Um, we also received some perfumes in our gift bag. There is Life Bloom and Tenderness. These mm -hmm. look like they'd be handy little like purse packs. Yeah. Um, and potentially like floral scented mm -hmm. perfumes. And then we have big this big one. It is Blooming Bouquet. This is an uh, Eau de Parfum. Wow, 35 mil. That's not bad. Big mm. size. And they're really affordable. I think they this one so was affordable. like 10 bucks or something. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's cute. It's pretty. It's really cute. I love the packaging. And I love the, um, like the, just the touch of the packaging. It's got the notes in it there does. as well. It does. So this is an elegant floral. Top notes, peach and orange. Middle, gardenia and jasmine. And dry down, vanilla and musk. Ooh. So there we go. Cute. cute. All right. Then we decided to go Christmas crazy. Yay! Well, not crazy, but we decided to get these hair clips, which yep. um like a little... Reindeer, reindeer horns hair clips. and um yeah you can just i don't look you could clip them i think in. you just clip them so we're going to yeah. wear them in a holiday video but that's, yeah that's just cute we Excited. were happy with that love it Cute um i got some practical stuff i bought some socks good um, socks are practical <laughs> to be honest these were like five or six dollars and i thought that they were one pair they're actually two pairs two pair. so i got a lot of socks um, and these are the kind of small socks that you can wear with shoes and not see the socks. Like, I hate ankle socks because they look dorky as fuck. When they, like, poke up the top of your... Yeah, no, no, yeah. no. So, I got white... They had different colours, they had different styles. They had, like, sh kind of sheer stocking ones. Um, but I just got these kind of basic ones. But they've got the rubberized bit in the inside. So I they really don't, like that. They don't, they don't slip, slip down underneath yeah. your heel, which is really good. So, um, I wear, like, sneakers a lot. 
I love those sort of socks. These I I own so many. They're just they're the only type that I enjoy. Yeah. Um, we got some cleansing wipes mm -hmm. in our gift bag. So it is clean and moisturized, soft touch, thirty five pieces. Cool. So there you go. Look, I use those a lot. Can oh. never go wrong. Swatches, removing makeup, whatever you like. Yeah, I always tend to use at least one when I'm doing my makeup. So yeah. Because I always put stuff in the back of my hand. I like to yeah. clean brushes really quickly. Um, we're really funny. Oh, we are funny. <laughs> we wanted to buy more spoons. Oh, they had too. such cool spoons and, and forks. forks. Yeah. And like spoons and forks with like <laughs> mouth. And, and like lips and eyes. Yeah. And, oh my god. They were crazy. crazy. They were cool. But we got these, and the reason I saw this was I was making poached eggs the other week, and I I didn't know what like I had to use something to get them out. Um, but whatever I used, it wouldn't really like drain properly, yeah. or the holes were too big. So I got this because it's perfect. And then Haley was yeah. like, "Oh, great idea! I'll get one too." Well, I have and like I used a, it, and it's really good. I've got a slotted spoon that I use for the poached eggs, but the way it's designed, it doesn't let the fluid flow out yep. properly so I always dump it on my toast and it, and it puts like, a lot of water on it Ugh. so yep. yeah I wanted to give it a go and it was they were cheap yeah. so you know but I, I did use it and it does work a treat I use it literally the next day excellent and I was just like perfect poached eggs well I'm done me poached eggs for breakfast tomorrow I might have some for lunch today good um bunny headband oh, i really cute. wanted one of yeah. these i saw them on the um the display and i was like i want one and there was one in our gift bag so i'm excited to be like i'm gonna put this on yep when i'm doing my makeup yep um and then one thing i got that i thought was hilarious um so these <laughs> These are two, I, I wanted to actually put these in my bathroom straight away, but then I was like, no, I need to save it for the haul. Uh, these are toothbrush holders, and essentially they're the kind of things that you um, stick it to like your mirror, and then you open it up, put your toothbrush and just hang it, and then clip it. Yeah. But it looks like Darren and me, so it's really funny. And, and they've got old couple old as couple. well. And I was like, that's for the future. Yeah. <laughs> I came home, at the moment we've got like a housemate. Um, Jamie, if you've seen our vlogs, and um, uh, I go, I'm like, sorry, Jamie, there wasn't one <laughs> there for wasn't you. One and he's wasn't... like, I don't feel like I'm part of the family anymore. And I'm like, there was no redhead with a beard. I'm really sorry, Jamie. <laughs> don't get these ones. So oh, um, poor Jamie. they should expand on the range so yeah. everyone can have one. I agree. Yeah, cute. Last thing that was in our goodie bag was this dude. Yeah. It's a Hello Kitty makeup bag, but it is full. Yeah, so essentially this was like a gift for the first hundred people that, because it was the store opening. Yes. So the first hundred people got this or like a cup. Uh, yeah, like a drink cup. So yep. inside, bunch of stuff. There is a um, BB cream. Mm -hmm. There is a lip balm. Oh, yeah. exciting. And they're all Hello oh, Kitty. This is really cute. This is Can cute. I just address this? So this is a hairbrush. Yeah. But then you open it up and it's a mirror. Yeah, but it's also like, it's got like the Hello Kitty. It's super cute. It's so cute. And there is also a little nail kit. Yeah. Which once again? Hello, Hello Kitty, Kitty. And a little mirror. Very, very cute. Really cute. I don't hate it. I don't all. hate it either. I love it. I, these. What is this? Uh, that'll be like uh, for cleaning under your nails. Ah. Yeah. Yeah. Look, probably need that. Yeah. So that's our little haul. Yeah. Super cute. Go and check it out. If you're in Melbourne, go and check out the store mm -hmm. down at Harbour Town. And I will say, Harbour Town's looking pretty good. Yeah. Um, they are like, it was known as like, it's like a shopping kind of outdoor complex yeah it's near the melbourne eye wheel it's near costco um they've just launched h&m mm -hmm. and they're like rolling out kind of big stores as well so it's definitely growing which yeah it's good to see it's worth checking out there's mm -hmm. a lot down there and um especially now that like spring is here and summer is coming mm -hmm. um they've also sort of put a little bit of a little Shade. bit of shelter yeah because it was sort of very outdoor and now it's a little bit more covered mm -hmm. um and it's just a really nice d place to spend mm -hmm. a warm day so yep. go check it out treat yourself with some shopping and you can see 
the vlog the, in store. If you want to see the vlog like, footage, keep watching. Is getting this one because it reminds her of a cat. Baby. Baby. Look! Look! Look how happy So it is. cute! I didn't get giant one. Oh shit! Oh shit! Look at it! Oh my god, they're so cute. They have a bunch of like gifting stuff, Christmas stuff, baubles, trees. They have these toothbrush holders. They're so cute. And it's like Cat and Darren. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. And that's us when we're old. Yes. Oh, I love it. 